Hello there. I hope you enjoy this playthrough of Man of Medan. I certainly did have a lot of fun playing it. And uh, if you can, like, upvote, share this video. It helps me out a great ton to continue making things in the internet. Thank you. The size is roughly correct too. Another book? Do you care to pick it up? Oh god, dude. If this text is as boring as the last one, I'm gonna quit halfway through. The skipper has code the booze for this whole goddamn trip. There's nothing like being sober to make you realize just how quiet the ship is. There was a fight between those dumb schmucks, Wilson and Anderson, right after we sailed, but Ferris nipped that in the bud real quick and it's been quiet as a church ever since. I got talking with a fellow who helped load up the ship. He told me they punched a they put a bunch of coffins on board, which isn't so weird maybe, but he said there was some guy who made sure the coffins were all put in one of the holes just right. Real precise. Not the treatment you'd get if you were any old grunt. I, it got me thinking, who could be in those boxes? Yeah, I think we kinda like know everything already. Also, it's just a lot of text. We already saw the, the hamster skull. Why wouldn't it be there? It has to be there. It just makes sense. What's this? A premonition! I wonder if this premonition does help us in any way, shape or form. Out of my way, Conrad. This room is useless. Get out. There we go. Now oh, this is where we came from. What? Another way to go? Wait. Did I miss something? Is there any way to get out of here? Oh yeah, there's another door. I didn't see it. Conrad is never in the way. Con Chad? What's this? Nothing. Waddle, waddle. I'm afraid there will be more quick time events. It is Olsen, Shh, from the Olsen Twins. Quiet. <laughs> this is the most random move ever. Why would he put it there? It's like entirely random. I'm gonna go get it. Now that's now now's the chance. The chance. Go get it. Yeah. Now. Do it. Okay. Right now. No better timing. Keep an eye out. Relationship update. Not sure. Oh shit. Oh shit. We need to quick time. She liked that. Others. 
Arrête de crier, j'essaie d'entendre ce qui se passe. Je crie pas. Ta gueule. Je veux savoir où sont les autres. Why does this guy not follow us, by the way? That doesn't make any sense. I think we lost Fliss. Fliss, I thought Fliss would fight a little bit, but she kind of didn't. <clears throat> Where are you taking me? Now, why would I tell you? Because everyone knows splitting up is OP. I think that's a very solid choice, yes. I mean, you're going. They're just following you. You're the leader, Fliss. Bit of a bunch of plot holes evolving there. I know, right? Waddle, waddle. You don't even know what you're doing. You just also, do whatever he tells why do I not have shoes? Like, this doesn't seem like the kind of ground where you would waddle without shoes. But preferably, you would have shoes in this kind of place. Controller movement. Why you be like that? Stop. Do you mean stop? Just waddle. Especially after she changed clothes, true. They they did hold her hostage when she basically only had her underpants. So she did change clothes. Why would she not bring some shoes? All right, come out. Show yourself. Damn it! Uh oh, we can see the fumes. We can see the fumes. That's not good. This fucking place is cursed. Yeah. Certainly. Surely the fumes won't don't no, won't mean anything bad. Look at this. NG Medan. Medan had found. Can I like put that on my head or something? What does that mean? Bearing updated? Fliss found a captain's hat with the name ending in G and the Medan after it. Military bandwidth? Oh. Speedboat? Julia had to use the knife to open the cockpit door, breaking it in the process. Conrad attacked Junior during the kidnapping. Conrad was unarmed, so Junior overpowered him. Alex pro so if we didn't kill the knife, we might have had a chance to actually kill someone. That's interesting. Maybe. They probably won't. What was that noise? What are you talking about? I don't want to hear anything from you. Awesome. That was a bit of a good jump scare. Please, you don't have to do this. Jesus! Oh Christ. Oh Christ. That guy. That guy's probably still right here with us. I mean, you die on a ship, your ghost stays on the ship. Um, you have no idea what you're talking about. Wasn't she the superstitious one in the beginning? Yeah, how about we touch him? That's a really good idea. Hello! How are you? Where did all your friends go? I don't know what the fuck this is all about. But we gotta keep moving and find Olsen. Yes, find now. Olsen. Didn't you just have Olsen right there? Screaming corpse, secret found. A terrified looking corpse. Looks as though they were cover covering away from something when they died. Oh shit, we have a lot of things here. I'm gonna not look at them. Olsen? Merde. Qu'est-ce que tu fais? Always, I, I also keep holding shift, but she doesn't move any faster. That was a little hand that moved. What is this? 
Ah, please let me look at the fucking picture, you dickhead. Look, enjoy the wrestling. A spoopy hand, yes. Did you see it? I can't just move on, unfortunately, so we have to look, I guess. Oh, that's useful. We take that. Oh, we can look at the picture now. Give me my premonition. Okay. Just imagine being barefoot in there. Yeah, it's absolutely disgusting. Wait, what? Is the plan to just waddle back? I kind of, like, I don't believe it. Even though it wouldn't be the worst of all options, right? No. Is anyone there? Just accept that the guy has disappeared. Wait. This looks like one of the things we opened before. Maybe we can open it again. So to get some food, so I'm back for a bit. Sounds good. Now what? Hmm. Nothing. Bottle, bottle. Oh, we're down here. That's progress. And the light just that turned off. Be a good sign. Now, this is perfect. Everyone knows less light is more fun. That's like a rule of life. Least less less light, more fun. We should go with that. Something was there. What happened down here? Oh, this was the the fake samurai incident. Charles T. Paris. Dog tag. Dog tag found on the call. There was U.S. military on board of the ship. Really? No way. U.S. military on this ship? That's light safer. A weird jump. Especially when trying to read a book. Yeah. That's not Charlie, that's Juan or something. Couldn't I wall into this direction too? I can. The camera movement is bad annoying though. Oh, a knife, poggers. Hmm. Bearing updated, police found the knife in the cargo hold. Nice. And where exactly did you just store it? Okay, you put it in your belt. However the fuck that is possible. But I guess we just accept it. Charles, could be Charlie? Okay, fair. I need to learn that trick to just like randomly store things in your belt. Mouse button. 
for just a second. Couldn't click it though. Wait, what? Oh yeah, the door is locked. Gotcha. Oh, Brad is alive. What is going on here? If she starts to have hallucinations, I would say hallucinations are more likely than actual ghosts. What is this? A bullet? Interesting. The rat, nice, nice. Hello there, Manny. Oh, fuck. Oh, wrong button. That was close. I'm trying to focus. That probably weren't zombies. That was probably our group of friends. What are we doing? I thought we were following them. We gotta keep our distance. Maybe not. This way we can get ahead of them. Let's hope it's faster. Compact ammo? Maybe a winnie? I got this. Roughly two hours in. <clears throat> Roughly two hours in. Two and a half, maybe. The zombies are a bit touchy-feely. They seem to be. But, as we have learned with the pickup artists, that's how you want to be. The last one was Chad. Yeah. What was that? Which is interesting because. Not funny. You know, we didn't see him for the majority of the game. Yeah, they have shoes. Everyone has shoes. Just Flitz decided to not bring shoes. For whatever reason. Maybe it's just about like... Wait a minute. We've been here before. Uh... I don't think so. I swear we've been here before, Alex. Have you been leading us in circles? Maybe it's just crowd-pleasing or something. Keep moving. What's that? Yes, look in, in random lockers. That's a good idea. Jesus! How is there still red? What is it? Flash in there. Truth will come. Look. <laughs> oh no! It's for yourself. They've got yeeted. Relationship upgraded. Yeah, Julia. I feel like Alex decided to be true. She liked that. Jesus Christ, we're really just trying to destroy the relationship between the two. And it's kind of fun. Onlyfeet.com, right. okay. What is this place? I'm thinking we gotta go through here. Keep I moving. know I saw something. It was moving in the shadows. Get a grip. It's probably just traps. Get a grip. Julia, just try to get a grip. Don't fucking laugh at me. <laughs> <laughs> we 
We would never laugh at her. No. Right, Not us. No. We're going around in circles. Well, what do you want to do? Turn around? We've seen all this before. Cool it, Jay. We don't have a lot of options. It's gotta be this way. Okay, no. This isn't working for me. What? Gross caskets and crappy chapels. Not my scene, you know? Dismissive. It's crappy. There's no such thing as ghosts. Oh, ghosts? There, there are ghosts now? Well, no. There's no such thing as... Well, you know that, and I know that. But do the ghosts know that? Good, good question, Listen, actually. Sure, it's freaky and it's disgusting and it's a little depraved, but they are just a bunch of dead bodies, and I'm sure they are going to stay dead. Yeah, the the girl's voice is um, very familiar. I would agree. Like all of these are real actresses too. I feel like I've seen her before too. Hey, we got a name on this guy. Brian Carter. I don't think stuck on a ghost ship for all eternity sounds like a good plan A. Who cares where they're from or where they're going? They're dead and we're not, so let's keep it that way. Connie decided to show feet policy. Wait, Connie? Who's Connie? Yeah, let's look inside here. That's a great idea. <laughs> it's two corpses. Defensive practically falling. Is this even human? Defensive? This was practically falling off anyway. Okay, that's enough with the bone buddies. I think it's just like two. Conrad, oh. Mila Kunis? Oof, that's I don't know. Serious honestly. locks in these caskets. Why would they be chained and locked? Well, that's one way to end a relationship. Ariel Public? Huh. Oh. We can't look at the last one, really? That's awkward. Oh, we can. Look at this one. Like for a kid or something. I don't want to know. Let's get out of here. Yes! Oh, Jesus. How do I, like, even find out where we are? I'm maybe that's little baby Dracula right there and those are his parents and they're lying in the dirt from their native country and, and then they all jump on Conrad and eat off his face <laughs> the end okay cool something will be going on here I guess matter? Shh. always a good idea oh. <gasps> what is it look what? Seriously? Are you trying to freak me out? Huh? Can we just get out of here? Yeah. We already know. Like, there's some mind... Some, some, some psychedelics in the air here. So let's see if we can foresee things. Can we please hurry? I'm done sightseeing. Roger that. We gotta get close. No time to lose. What the hell is making that sound? What sound? Yeah, he's going. He's going insane already. Why so spick and span? Yeah, they're tripping their balls off. Apparently, she did some minor parts in different games, Deus Ex, for example. Interesting. What? Fuck! Hey, this is no time to be fucking around. I'm serious. I can't take it. Boo hoo. His face looks kind of good. Yeah, touch him. Touch him. Oh, what the fuck? Don't touch it. Why did you touch it? <laughs> she got a point, though. She got a point. Why did we touch it? Touch him again. Do it again. Come on. Let's touch it. Yeah, let's just go this way. Where the hell is Conrad? Conrad? Maybe just get in some air. Conrad! I mean, real with you, I've never really watched Family Guy. What the hell? So I, I can't really comment on that. It's like he died of fright. 
You can't see that. Her corpse whose face is frozen in expression of terror. It looks almost as if they have been frightened to death. Uh, I mean... Potentially? Oh, wrong button. Let's go. What is this? Hello? Okay, so this guy had appendicitis, which is pretty routine, and then, then he died of a massive heart attack, which is not routine at all. Yeah. Hashtag nope. Nope. Hashtag. I kind of thought the corpse would move there. Connie? Connie! That 70s show is one she was in? Oh. Connie, where the fuck are you? Connie. Bearing update. Alex didn't find anything of use in the kitchen. Yeah. Where Alex, Conrad? why did you not find anything? Connie! Hey, Conrad! Where the hell did he go? Keep, keep crying. Oh, dude, Julia, Julia fucking hates our guts. Oh my god. <laughs> Ah, uh, we did amazing with that. Oh shit, man's got a hammer. What in God's name is this? Oh shit. Okay, so we have to make a decision now. Like, the fact that we constantly have, like, visions and stuff has a very high chance of us seeing, like, characters that we have to fight that are not actually evil. Because that's just, like, the logic of things. Um, should we, like, trust on it? This place is not right. Let's keep your head on straight. Oh, another premonition. Hmm. Exactly, but maybe that's the problem, isn't it? A lever? Surely we will click every lever we find. Video game logic. Well, this gone from military boat to cruise ship. I think that's what she feels is not right about it. This is too weird. We have to use the stairs. There is no way around. I guess we could just not open the coffin, but how much fun would that be? Also, notice that the floor seems to be some kind of red liquid. Should we just leave? Leave that alone? That would be kind of funny. Come on. Yeah, okay. I guess. Get some fresh air. The Dracula moment, certainly. Yeah, this kind of, this kind of, like, explains the whole scenario. The fresh air makes it that we can, like, think again. It's just a psychedelic. The cheap jump scares are kind of weird, yeah. 
Why can I not click this? I want to click this. Hello? Hello? For the love of God, let me interact with this thing. Okay, I guess we're not interacting with it. But how did we get through here? That's awkward. This seems pretty locked tight, honestly. It's either a plot hole or there's a good explanation for it that we didn't understand yet. There's no way I cannot interact with this coffin. Oh, now I can move on this side. Come on, do it. Manchurian gold? Interesting. Large stacks of large stack box of crystals and Hessian bags with the world Manchurian gold essential on the side. The hold is floored, flooded. It looks like there has been a chemical leakage in the cargo hold too. Update the chemicals are weaponized hallucinogens from the Manchurian gold research. Yeah, I mean we we kind of knew that. But cool. Can we now leave? Thank you.